Hello, I'm Dr. Carolyn Richardson, and I would like to thank all of my returning viewers and my subscribers. And I would like to welcome all new viewers, and I encourage anyone who is not already a subscriber to become one. Today, I just want to let the people know over there that I met in Houston on Monday, October 8th at I-45 and West Rittenhouse that I truly enjoyed working with them. I did a cooking demonstration where I showed them how to make a chopped salad. We had a lively discussion where we talked about healthy lifestyle changes and I wanted to make sure they understood that they were doing a good job at make, choosing to eat more healthy foods. We talked about how addiction to sugar is worse than the addiction to alcohol or cocaine. When you eat sugar and starchy foods, you just want to eat more and more and more. And we know that's not good for you. Don't you notice when you eat bite-sized candies, you just keep putting one after the other after the other. But it's not that way with vegetables. When you eat vegetables, it makes your body feel full and satisfied, and you don't want to continue to eat. We made the chopped salad by using broccoli, cauliflower, green cabbage, and kale. We got a head start because we didn't use the whole vegetables. We got the cauliflower florets already cut up, and we got the broccoli florets already cut up, so we just had to make them little smaller pieces. Instead of uh, chopping up cabbage, we used the coleslaw mix that's already in a bag, the shredded green cabbage, little bits of red cabbage, and little bits of carrot. The only thing we had to prepare were the kale leaves, and we chopped those up in small pieces using a food processor. We combined the kale and the cauliflower pieces and the broccoli floret pieces and the, dumped the uh, coleslaw mix all in a huge bowl and stir them up. I then added grated carrots to that and we microwaved some chicken nuggets, cut them into four pieces and used them for croutons. We stirred in some prepared chicken salad and some additional prepared coleslaw for good flavor. Everyone tasted it and said, realized that it tasted really good and many people decided that they now knew a new way to add more vegetables to their diet each day. I reminded them that they want to make sure to drink plenty of water and to get 30 to 60 minutes of aerobic exercise each day. We have videos on this channel that will help you with that. One video is called 10, Add 10,000 Steps to Your Day. Another video, Confetti Vegetables, Making Veggies Tasty. And the third video, that we have that will help with that is entitled Stay Cool, Eat Cucumbers. You can search for all of these on this channel. I would also like to let that awesome medical student, Andrea Pinto, know that I appreciate her giving me this opportunity to talk to people and encourage people who are making healthy lifestyle changes. I would also like to thank the staff at the residence over there at West Witten House who purchased the food and the supplies and helped us with support and did all they could to make this event a success. If you found the information in this video to be helpful, click the thumbs up button. You can also press the subscribe button. That way you will be notified when we update this channel. I'd like to thank you for watching Doc Seavage 3 TV and remember, as always, do all that you can to stay healthy and safe.